Prepare for the TOEFL listening section with this sample lecture on personality development. Listen to the lecture, answer some questions about it, then check your answers. If necessary, review the lecture to confirm your understanding. Subscribe for more practice lectures on a wide range of academic topics, covered in college and university classes. Personality refers to the unique pattern of thoughts, feelings, and behaviors that distinguishes one individual from another. Understanding personality is essential for comprehending human behavior, relationships, and well-being. Firstly, let's consider the major theories of personality development. One prominent theory is the psychodynamic perspective, which emphasizes the role of unconscious processes, early childhood experiences, and internal conflicts in shaping personality. According to Sigmund Freud's psychoanalytic theory, personality is structured into three components, the id, ego, and superego, each representing different aspects of the psyche. Another influential theory is the trait perspective, which posits that personality can be understood in terms of stable and enduring traits or characteristics. Trait theories such as the five-factor model, also known as the Big Five, identify broad dimensions of personality, including openness, conscientiousness, extraversion, agreeableness, and neuroticism. These traits provide a framework for understanding individual differences in behavior across various situations. Furthermore, social cognitive theories of personality emphasize the interaction between personal characteristics environmental influences, and behavior. Albert Bandura's social learning theory, for example, highlights the role of observational learning, self-efficacy, and reciprocal determinism in shaping personality development. It's essential to recognize that personality development is a dynamic and multifaceted process influenced by various factors, including genetics, upbringing, culture, and life experiences. While genetic factors contribute to the predisposition towards certain personality traits, environmental factors, such as parenting styles, peer relationships, and cultural norms, also play a significant role in shaping personality. Moreover, personality development is not static, but continues throughout the lifespan, undergoing gradual changes and fluctuations in response to life events, transitions, and personal growth. Research in developmental psychology highlights the importance of early experiences in laying the foundation for personality development, but also acknowledges the potential for change and adaptation across the lifespan. One, what is personality as defined in the lecture? Two, according to Sigmund Freud's psychoanalytic theory, how is personality structured? Three, what is the primary focus of the trait perspective in understanding personality? Four. Which of the following is not one of the dimensions of personality identified in the five-factor model? Five. What do social cognitive theories of personality emphasize?
6. How does the lecture characterize personality development? How did it go? Were you able to answer the questions correctly? Share your score in the comments below. Like, comment, and subscribe for more TOEFL listening practice with lectures.